hey, just want to share a fun way that I'm using Notion with you. Um, so often I have to recommend technology to my clients. And at Okie Doki, we obviously have our sort of preferred technical stack. And so we're often recommending a lot of the same products and services to our clients over and over again. So what I've done is I've created this tech tools database. And um, over time, every time we sort of acquire new tools and, and that sort of thing, we'll add them to this database and um, categorize them, tag them, add details about pricing and that sort of thing. And then we will basically embed a filtered view of this database into a client project area. And so if I kind of click through and look at one of these, uh, we recommend Drip for email marketing. I can even include my affiliate link in there if I want to. Um, a short overview of the purpose, I tag it, give it a monthly price as well so the client kind of knows how much they, they're going to be spending if they use this tool. And I give it a status from must have to already using, worth considering, that sort of thing. And then that way, it's kind of a nice summary for the client of you know tools they're already using, tools that we know that they're going to need, um, and even some that might need... Um, uh, need an overview, you know, like it might be um, a recommendation for the client to take a look, sign up for a free trial and that sort of thing. And we can add some notes here as well. Um, and I refined this also by must have tools. So that's just everything that's filtered by status is must have. Um, and then I can create unique client views for these as well. I won't do that here, but basically you'll get to see this um, of course, you can view it in a few different ways. You can view it as a table, as a gallery. I'm a visual person, so I love seeing it in this nice gallery with all those features. You can, of course, do something like this where you can also you know, calculate the sum and get a rough sense of if the client signed up for all of the tools that you're recommending, what's the sort of monthly fee that they're expecting. Um, but this kind of gives like a nice overview and summary and um, yeah, I can again filter that by client. I can filter it by certain properties, you know, only show me everything that's related to email or file storage and that sort of thing. And it's just like a nice clean way to store all of this beautiful data.